Hello guys, this is Dr. T and today I'm gonna do this uh, main quest on Islands of Hills. So yeah there is uh Whitman, our enemy is in here, so let's beat his ass. Let's do it. Traitor is lost in hell by now. They will have <sighs> lost souls of the dead to answer to. Feel stronger already. All right. Let's talk to Soma. Her. Eivor, you're still with me through all this. Do not think I'll forget. We all need someone in dark times. Now let's collect Whitman's head. Good. At the first sign of trouble, my crew will jump in. Alright. Ah. Hmm. There. He's hiding mm. at the summit of the hill. I can smell him. I hope he likes the view. It's the last he'll ever see. Lightning tingles my blood, Eivor. I hear the voices of my slaughtered people on the air, calling Wigman's name. He doesn't leave this monastery alive. All right. What mm. see you, old friend? I think. Uh, it's there. Alright, so let's go. Best raise my hood here. Yeah, that's right. Oh, my palms itch. Where is that rat? Hmm. Skin him alive on sight. Uh, a lot of soldiers in here. I will tear his throat from his neck with my teeth. I taste Wigman's fear on the air. My fingers itch for his life, Eivor. Wow. Patience. I'll attack when it's time. This is looks like a... Oh, she's gonna torture him. Hmm. Let's climb up. Hmm, I think this building is... very suspicious. Still, we could not hold the city. That raving the pagan has me, and you dirty churls lost it for me. Where is that? Ah, there you go. Hmm, this is traditional assassin move. Let's assassinate. me from your minds fight in my name die for me die for me that mm. is no way to go for sacrifices that's right oh, for yours. is that how it works their lives meant nothing no land no riches no titles but my name will live on 
The reputation of a good man never dies. But your name will soon be a curse. Hmm, that's a... that's a lot. So be it. The riches I had in life gave me power. To curse me from beyond the grave gives me still more. Though I die, my order lives on elsewhere, everywhere. Yield to us. Give us what we are owed. The trade, the riches, the legacy, all of it. Mm, you can't escape. Yield, yield, yield! You can't run away from me. If your hell is real, I'm glad you'll get to see it. Where are you going, Odin? Come, brothers. Let's end this. Let's get out of here. We should return to camp before I let go. Burned as he hit the ground. Going forward, we must take care. Houses can be built anew. Crops will return with time. Return to the camp. Hmm. Yeah. How how do you like my move? That was like a assassin move, right? Yeah, brothers. I got one. Eivor, you've been a guiding light. Calling out Galen like that, exposing his treachery, made me sick with a quiet terror. I did what Oda demanded. A trail like that is That's all a nice kind line. of death. Galen killed himself. Of course. And now I feel somewhat lifted. The weight is almost gone. Even if my heart needs mending. Ah, while I have you, Eivor, I'm reminded. I have this for you. Keep it, knowing you have my highest respect, regard, and trust. My army is yours, should you need it. Soma Yaltskona. My deepest thanks. And, there's something else. What is that? As we prepared our assault, Birna had a word with me. We came to a sort of understanding. It may be best if she tells you herself. Until next time, Eivor of the Raven Clan. I hope we will see you in Grandbridge soon. Hmm. Birna, you struck quite a victory today. Don't undercut your own ferocity, Drengir. It was your blade leading the charge. You are indeed something to behold. We all thought hard. And now Grand Brit is yours. You have your home once again. Ah, soon merchants and priests and reeves will run loose in its streets. All of its muddy charms will dwindle. Besides, with no room for me in Soma's heart, my home burned wow. away in a quiet little house fire. Mm -hmm. Her priority is Grandbridge and the people in it. That is noble and beyond what I will ever understand. So I've decided mm. I'm of better use elsewhere. With you. In your crew. Oh. You want to live with the Raven Clan? And sail and raid with you. If you'll have me. Look at this. Who would it? I'll be happy to have you, Drenga. A relief to these ears. I've already packed my bags. That's nice. That's nice. I like her. And it's very good to, you know, have her in my clans. Yep. Seems the wind calls me 
back to Randvi. Let's tell her the good news. Shared history. Cool. Oh. Spreads of the fates stretch up with the world and time, pulling together kind of spirits to confront a common enemy. That's right. I think so. Alright, so go back to the Raven's door and speak to Randy. Uh, Raven's door. Well, where is where is ah uh, here? All right, fast travel. That's useful. Eivor. Uh, Eivor next time? Get a bit of practice in. Absolutely not. Understood. We are allied with the Danes of Granderbridge Shire. Their Jarlskona, Soma, has pledged an oath. Well done, Eivor. These early victories will pay off well. They will. In more than one way, one of Soma's finest fighters, Birna, has pledged her blade to us. She's a powerful fighter and a charming spirit. I think she'll fit in nicely. Glad to have her. Good work. Alright. At one time, the title Jarl referred to a man second only to the king, but that use has softened. Now a Jarl may be a chief, a leader, or a man with broad wealth and influence. The world is bigger now, and broken into many pieces. It seems our language must do the same to keep up. <laughs> An interesting thought. Chill, Bernd. Your father sent you here to learn, not teach. Then you must start, Eivor. Give us a summary of our recent gains, for instance. The clan is thirsty for knowledge. You want me to give a speech? Ooh. Right. Where is the cigarette? My friends, hearken to me, and hear a tale of triumph and toil. I have traveled far since we landed, and seen much on the roads and fields of this new England. And for all my travels, strong alliances have we gained. The honorable Cheowulf, King of Mercia, now calls his friend. To the south, Soma Yal's corner, and the Danes of Granderbridge have pledged their oath to us. By Sigurd's hand and my own, we have strengthened the ties of... You seat yourself as Sigurd's equal in these tales of yours. Would Sigurd do the same if he were here? Hmm. Sigurd knows what I have achieved, and he would celebrate it more roundly than I have. But this takes nothing from you, all of you. For I sit among some of the staunchest wills and strongest fighters I have ever known. And so I raise my horn, first to Sigurd, may he return to us soon, and to the Raven Clan, the best of friends and fighters. To Sigurd! To Sigurd! May he return and relieve us of you! And may all of you enjoy the ale as much as Dag has. Skull! Skull! You think me drunk, Eivor? Would it soften my blows if I was? Your words are blunt enough. But it would explain your boldness. My eyes are clear and open. And I see before me one eager to claim a piece of Sigurd's glory. Hmm. 
obviously he loves Sheikh Sigurd. Hmm, I respect that. All you say is nonsense, Stag. Have I done something to raise your ire? Just as I thought. You're attackers from the river. What? They have to be Danes. Danes? How many? Too many. Now come. The battle roar is already. Bloody curse. What quarrel have Danes with us? Those who can fight, take off your weapons. All others stay here. Wow. With me. <laughs> Abel's charisma isn't bad yet. What? Who is that? That will cost you. Don't force me to stir your thirst for battle around me. the last of them the rivers are clear if more were coming they thought better of it are there colors and markings i believe they come from gidland are there none left alive to spill the secrets we may never know why here is one <clears throat> this vermin was crawling to the river hoping to float away uh, have mercy friend and you may find an ally with us. Mercy is earned by the quickness of your tongue. Where do you come from and what is your quarrel with us? We are settled it's in East Anglia. Uh -huh. Newly arrived and hungry for silver. You drifted off course. This is Mercia. As we were ordered. By whom? For me. What? Useless hound. Scratching your ass in search of silver. Put an end to this one. Your silence earned you no kindness, Geet. So I'll ask you once more. Who sent you? The wind sent us. And the rivers will take us home. He what? begs for death, Eivor. Give it to him. Or send him home with a warning. Let him tell his people what death awaits them, should they sail this way again. Hmm. That's a good idea. Go, and do not return. <sighs> I thank you. This is not mercy, it is death deferred. Whoever sent you warn them of the slaughter that awaits should any return. Oh, what tales I will tell. Send one of your scouts to follow him. We will find. Wow. 
To show mercy would endanger us, soil our reputation as cowards. This was the only end possible. We could have learned something by tracking him. Now we know nothing. Sigurd would have acted as I did. That is all the justification I need. Sigurd is not here to make such a call, but I am. And if you cross me again, you will know about it. I see you, Eivor. And I know what you are. Was be smart, man. Put no stock in what Dag says. His bluster may be loud, but it blows softly. Get this cleaned up, and we'll talk of next steps. Alright, so thank you for watching my channel guys and see you at the next videos. Bye bye.